Hi everyone, I'm Tabang Kupamore. I'm a student at NW Pochestrom campus. Hey, um, my name is Sifesile Felicity Salasle. I am a fourth year public governance with public administration and politics student. My Instagram handle is at Sifesile's diary. Get a I'll be having what she's saying. Also, I'm asking. It's to ask the guys that will be sister. I'm a good dude. 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 Um, so my question for you is, what makes you unique? Okay, what makes me unique? Uh, I would say, I'm just a working young person. Uh, there's an, I'm not that I consider myself as a simple person, but most of my friends say I'm complicated. Interesting, very interesting. Yeah. Um, my second question is, what are some random fun facts about you? Random fa uh, fun facts? Wow. My fun? Okay, let me, let me see. I'm a clown. If you get to know me, <laughs> I'm a clown. Um, I am a cloud, like honestly, like in my safe space, I get to be myself, like mm. singing in the shower, like people see me as, as this straightforward person, because like on social spaces, like, you know, handle business as usual, but get to your space, I get to my personal space, I'm a cloud. Makes sense, makes yeah. sense. I think I'm also like that, like very serious, but I'm not stressing okay. me. I think the real question is, am I looking though? Because, <laughs> I don't know, I, yeah. I can't say I'm really mm -hmm. looking for yeah, yeah. something specific. Okay, I'm not actively looking for anything, yeah, yeah. but I think like if I do start looking, mm -hmm. like, I don't know, I believe a man person, so I don't really look. Yeah, yeah. Um, but I'm looking for like security, mm -hmm. like being safe also. Because yeah. I think when I'm like safe, um, or when I'm around someone that makes me feel safe, I get to like move in love, mm -hmm. and then I'm like the softest version of myself. Yeah, yeah. So yeah. Doesn't it like get lonely? I don't really know if it gets <laughs> lonely, but um, I work out a lot. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So yeah, yeah. most of the time, I'm genuinely just becoming fully aware of my space and then I'm just like, I'm very happy like with myself currently so it doesn't really get lonely. Yeah, maybe you want to go for a coffee or so with someone but then yeah. I think I have my friends also, they make it easy. Yeah, yeah, but yeah. if I'm very, very, very lonely then everything that I want someone to be for me, I do for myself so I think that's how I just like deal with loneliness. Wow. Yeah. What's something you want to learn or you wish you were better at? Something I want to learn. Um, I would say I want to learn how to swim. Yeah. Mm. I don't know Makes how to swim. Yeah. yeah, I do can swim, but I'm not. Yeah. Not so great. Yeah, I'm not so great. It's understandable. Yeah, it's rare to find a black person that can swim. How religious are you? Um, if we work on a scale of one to ten. Okay. Okay, I would say a good nine. I'm very strict when it comes to religion, actually. Mm. Um, so yeah, on a scale of one to ten, I'd say nine. So you go to church often? Mm. Yeah, most of the time. Yeah, yeah. Who are the special people in your life? Who are the special people in my life? Uh, my sister, first of all. My sister, uh, 
my two, my okay, my three sisters. And why? And why? <laughs> And I am an uncle. I'm, 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 I'm a new, I'm a new uncle. I have a niece, so yeah, that's a t that adds to the list. So yeah. So you love babies. Baby girls, to be specific. Oh, you love girls. It has to be a baby girl. Mm. Hallelujah. <laughs> okay. <laughs> yeah. uh, I, I feel like religion is what you believe in, mm. but are you connected to what you believe in? That's where the spirituality part comes in. That's what I think. Mm. Yeah. Then I'm very spiritual. Just to answer your question. Because I believe in the like I believe in being like a Christian because I've seen how it works for me. Yeah, yeah. Um, not necessarily how it works for me, but I think Christ has truly saved me mm -hmm. from a lot of things in my life. Mm -hmm. So looking at even just okay, so I'm a person that's obsessed with the sunset or sunrise, whatever. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So how can you not believe in God if you see that? I bet you wake up every day just to see the sunrise. 5 a.m. club, sir. Hey. <laughs> what do you think happens in the afterlife? I think we get, I think every question that you have right now mm -hmm. will truly be answered. Do you understand what I'm saying? I think you become truly, it's like you finally get to a place where you understand everything that you had to go through in life. Because I think every day I live my life out like fully. So even if Christ had to come today, I am I'm ready because I know I did what I had to do. Wow, wow. Um, so I think it's all, I think that's the thing. I think as young people also, we have this thing of like, no, but like maybe later, later when Christ yeah. comes, I'll truly be at a perfect place where I'm ready. Yeah. But you're never truly ready. I think every day you must be ready for, if Christ decides to come like today, you must be ready for like, okay, did I do and fulfill every purpose that he has for me? What is it that you're proud of? I think this is going to sound very cliche, but I'm really proud of myself. <laughs> yeah. um, yeah, man, I think most of the time we don't give ourselves enough credit, but I'm really proud of myself and the person that I'm really becoming. Mm -hmm. Like, I'm not a quitter. Mm -hmm. So sometimes seeing how I just choose to endure and go through things and still come out and help. You know, yeah. um, it's just, you know, it's wonderful for me to see because then I sit there and I'm in awe of how much strength I actually have. Mm. You are who you think you are. Because mm. mm. some people, do have an idea who they are, but then like generally they feel some other way. But I I get I get that you are who you think you are and be that person. Oh, yeah. So I just want to ask you. This is very interesting. I think it's a question we don't really ask men a lot. So I just want to know from your side, what does love mean to you? I believe love. Uh, should not be uh, superficial rather if i'm to give you love i should i should show you through my act mm. like you said in uh, like you said earlier on that you need security you know i should be there for you uh, there are times where you are in need of you know just a space of conversation you know that's that's what i feel like love is for uh, for you to be there with someone in your most vulnerable moments, you know, moments where you feel like, you know, this I can't tell it to the world, but mm. I need that one person to share it with, you know, that's love, man. I mean, there's there's more to love than intimacy. Yeah, there's true. more to love than. I definitely get what you're saying, and I totally agree with it. But I think we have truly limited love, also, like as. I don't want to say, well, let's say as a society, because mm -hmm. I think when someone asks you what love means to you, it's quick, like you're very quick to think about, okay, mm -hmm. relationship. Yeah. Um, but like I said, I feel like we have limited it truly. What about friendship? What about yourself? Do you love yourself enough to be like, okay, I trust my friends with me or I trust a specific partner with me? Because mm -hmm. I think love is truly demonstrated on how you treat yourself as an individual also mm -hmm. before you give yourself to anyone. Mm -hmm. So I'm glad that you actually started mentioning your mother before you went into the relationship context because it mm -hmm. shows that you didn't limit it to just 
you know, like your partner. Because it's so mm. easy to be a loving partner, but then mm. you're like, yes, you know, yes, not yes. a good boy there at home. Yes, you know? yes, so, yes. Um, I think I'm very glad that you. Yeah. 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 What else comes? You know the game? It's Scrabble. Yeah. yeah. Okay. What do you want to be remembered as at the end of your life? Like, what do I want to be? Yes, yes, yes. Um, so, I'm naturally a very present person. Mm -hmm. um, so I want to be remembered as the person that was always there. Mm. Knowing that whatever you were going through or whatever that was going on, I want my family or my friends what significant other it happens. Yes. Um, I want them to know that, like, I'll, like I want them to stand one day and say she was always there. Yeah. You yeah. could always count on her. Mm -hmm. Interesting question. You okay, cannot ask. Would you do anything for love? Uh, I would do anything. I would go up and beyond. You know, I would go an extra mile. You know, just to make sure I could see the significant other is okay. You know, you understand. So. But there comes a time, there comes a line, a fine line, where you have to know how to, because love is a dangerous thing. Mm. It's dangerous, but it's easy. It's, it's dangerous, you see? It's dangerous and it's easy at the same time. But there comes a time where it can be dangerous for you to do anything for love. Have you had any business idea or ideas I only put in two sugars downstairs because I didn't want everyone to know that I have a very sweet tooth. Um, but I've always wanted to have like a candy shop. Hey. I have a very, very sweet tooth. tooth. Yeah. Um, I'm just scared that most of the time I'll eat um, all the candy. Mm -hmm. But I've always wanted to own a candy store. A candy store. Or some sort of chocolate factory. Okay. And then, if not, I want to start my own gym brand. Well, okay. Yes, yes, yes. Yeah. So, you know how they always say, you don't have must. You don't have must, yeah. Must have a van, must have a Halax, but... <laughs> Brings me to my question. Yes. How important is money in a relationship? Uh, how important is money in a relationship? Uh, you know that movie, Lo Love Doesn't Cost a Thing, or what is it called? It's somewhere there? Don't watch movies. Okay, yeah, I do believe you do have to provide for your lady. You do have to take care of your lady. Uh, so, as a guy, you do have to have ways of making money, you know? Um, so I just want to know, do you think not having money would truly affect um, your relationship? No. So you don't think it would affect your relationship? It won't affect, because I believe the love that I give mm. is enough. Yes, the money buys the flowers. Yeah, days, dates, the yes. But at the end of the day, I think, where's, I always ask, where's the character also? Because okay. you can have all the money, but if yeah. you lack character, character yeah. if I don't feel like you respect me now, yes, when yeah. you're angry or you don't know how to talk to me, yes, then, yeah. it's like where I draw the line. Yeah. Just secure the bag. Yes, secure the bag, but secure yourself also, sir. Are you emotionally stable? Are you fine? Yes, ma'am. You know, yes, ma'am. So my question for you is Manchester United or Arsenal? None of the above. Is this the like point of great like <laughs> <laughs> I feel good, mm -hmm. then I get to do good. And I love taking care of the temple of God, which is my body. Um, so yeah, I think I genuinely enjoy going to the gym because if I feel good about myself, then I get to do a lot of good things. I don't know if that answers your question. Wow, answers everything. <laughs> Do you like your iced coffee with cubes or crushed ice? None of the above. Oh, you don't drink iced coffee? It's my first time today, and thank you. You know, uh, it's nice though. It's nice, mm -hmm. it's nice. Uh, uh, you probably have a hectic schedule. Mm, yeah. yeah. Okay. How off? What do you guys mean? You're talking cryptic. Like. <laughs> <laughs> uh, how often, like, do you want to see your partner? Um, I don't know. I'm a very loving person and I love being 
around someone that makes me safe, feel safe, like I said. But I would love to see my partner. Uh, let's say four times a week. Is that a lot? <laughs> my final question mm. is, do you listen to country music? You mean like South African country music? Any country music. Della Ray, Della Ray. Yeah, that's my favorite mm -hmm. song. I don't know the lyrics, but he is. <laughs> Do you listen to country? Ah, uh, no. That's it. We're done. <laughs> <laughs> Besides gym? Besides, you know, you being with your friends, like, what is it that you do that that is you? I watch sports. I love sports. I'm big on sports. Okay. I watch play sports, anything. Like, if you tell me now, let's go play tennis. Even if I don't know how to, I'll go. Because mm. I know how to play netball and I know how to play mm. When is the next match in Poch? The netball match, next week. Am I coming along?